Okay, so here we have a pretty amazing rendering by Dan. This looks really good. There's a detail on the bolts. Cylinders are not put into place yet. The quick attaches, and that's that's looking pretty good. We need to have the location of the hull for the for the pin of the quick attach. We have the two cylinders, excellent, but not in place yet. Um, where will that cylinder attachment go? So this cylinder and well, actually these are reversed because this fixed end should go like about there and the rod end should be going around like the somewhere in between but about vertically down from the edge but the mounting plate for that will be right here we can do a plate right here and extend it so it you can attach the the cylinder to it it's not going to be easy uh, we're going to need some form of ears and some s really strong reinforcement. This plate here would probably have to be like one, one inch, I would make it. Good thing about the cylinder is that they fit into that gap that's in between the, the beams. So the cylinders happen to fit right in there. Well, this is looking like great work so far. The overall backhoe is coming together. We still do have to do motion analysis on a, on a stick and curl cylinders and we will mount the boom cylinder here on a platform that's bolted down and then has some ears coming up here, but the exact details will have to be determined by something like QCAD or something to show the exact range of motion. That's about it.